Hi everybody! Steve is digging out some forbs that grew in our air prune beds this year. You can see what's left of our persimmons down on the far end. And I wanted to just show you the roots. So we're going to go take a look at the cart full of this plant. And I'm going to tell you a little bit more about it when we go look. But you can see that obviously the roots were super happy because look how much soil came with them. <laughs> These aren't going to be bare roots, so let's go take a look at them. Okay, so here we are with the whole cart of plants that Steve just dug out of here. Check this out. These are solid masses, everybody. I mean, huge, solid masses. Now, that's not going to be surprising to any of you that have grown mints before. So this is a native mint. This is hairy wood mint, Bophelia hirsuta, it's Lamiaceae. And mints have a very distinguishing characteristic of having a square stem. And they're also super popular with pollinators. And they spread pretty rapidly, which in the right areas is just brilliant to behold because they stabilize soil and then they offer so much abundant food for wildlife and then of course opportunities for you to partake in their scents and their tea whatever you want to do this has always been one of our favorite plants to visit when we're over at Mohican here in Ohio we love to rub the leaves and just it transports us to this other world and it stays green throughout the winter and just offers this this deep connection to when everything is growing and thriving and the sheer abundance of it all seems impossible when you're in the middle of winter. So we're planting just big clumps of this throughout this open, a little bit wet area here uh, on, in the fence row. And Steve did several of them on our stream. And then we're going to put a couple, a couple other places. So I just wanted to show you, here's a super hardy native, very easy to grow. And I'll put a link in the description so that you can learn a little bit more about it. But hairy wood mint makes sense. It's a mint and it's hairy. There you go. Another one for you to plant in your wildlife haven.